Autodesk Vault 2013 contains a number of improvements to existing CAD workflows, particularly for Autodesk Inventor users. The Open and Place dialog in Vault 2013 has been redesigned to feature a file detail grid, bringing added convenience and efficiency to one of the most commonly used commands. The grid permits users to sort, group by column, and add or remove columns from the right-click menu. Customize the dialog with a list of frequently used details or create shortcuts directly from the dialog. A new quick search command enables you to search the current folder and visible grid properties for keywords. Searches can be expanded with basic search, giving you the option to open your most common searches, as well as access and save file shortcuts. In addition to the dialog changes, Vault 2013 features three important workflow enhancements specifically for users of Autodesk Inventor. The first of these workflows is iPart and iAssembly dependency. Autodesk Vault now downloads and checks out all affected instances of iPart and iAssembly families during factory updates to help keep them in sync. The second change around common Inventor workflows is improved support for level of detail. Vault 2013 now enables users to add assemblies that contain suppressed components. As an automatic part of the check-in operation, Vault identifies and includes any suppressed parts. Lastly, in response to one of the most frequently requested Inventor enhancements, the ability to add associated files to Vault is now available. Now when users add or check in model data, they are able to filter, search for, and add related design documents such as IDW, DWG, and IPN files. Design documentation that shares a name with the model or resides in the project workspace, content center, or libraries can be included. Together, these multiple enhancements all add up to a much simpler and productive user experience that helps not only to reduce design errors, but can also lead to significant time savings over the life of the design process.